my channel. My name is Anna Karen. How are you? Long time no see it feels like just because I'm not posting two times a week and you're only getting videos from me on Sundays. It feels like a long time. Like I haven't picked up my camera all week and it feels so weird. So today is Friday and today is the last day that I will have a naked nose. <laughs> um, I am about to go get my nose pierced and I've thought about this long and hard. Um, I keep thinking I want it, I keep thinking I don't want it because I'm a weenie. <laughs> I'm actually really nervous because I don't know how I'm going to react to the pain. I feel like my pain tolerance is very low sometimes depends I mean if a big needle is gonna be stuck through my nose I don't think I'm gonna be able to handle that so I hope I don't pass out and I already knew that um, me wanting to go get my nose pierced I couldn't go alone in the case that I do pass out um, I don't have $2,000 laying around to go and pay for an ambulance. <laughs> I've never been one to have a bunch of piercings, but for maybe like about a year now, I mean, I know it's not that long, I've been wanting a piercing. Um, the thing is, is, I want like a nose ring, but I mean, obviously when you first get your nose pierced, you need to have the stud, but that is the look that I'm going for is a gold nose ring. I actually looked at a bunch of different reviews on Yelp too. There's a bunch of good reviews for a, a bunch of different places, but there's always that one review that is like the worst, the worst of anything that can happen, and it like, <laughs> it unmotivates me to get one. But I've decided and I'm going to do it. I'm going to Cali Tattoo and Piercing, I believe. It's on Broadway. This is the last time you guys are going to see me without a piercing. I keep saying that. I just feel like because things like this definitely change the way that you're, you look. Like my face appearance. appearance. My face appearance is going to be so much different. I'm going to go wash my face right now. You're probably going to see me in different clothes. I'm trying to be more comfortable. But yeah, I'm going to take off my makeup. I'm going to wash my face because I don't want a risk of any infection and to make me just feel better. <laughs> so if you want to see me get my nose pierced, then keep on watching. Nice deep breath in and out. Oh. <laughs> hey, welcome back. This is after. So when I went to go get my piercing, it was Friday. Um, I Today is Sunday. I wanted to do it on a Friday night. That way I didn't have to wear makeup over the weekend so that I can give it just a couple days to heal without having to worry about getting infected with my makeup. I don't know. It's some weird thing that I like. I just I want to be safe, okay? <laughs> Obviously, you cannot see it where you are. So I'm going to scoot in just a little bit. That way you can see. And I know... I'm a little oily because um, today is Sunday and it was the Super Bowl Sunday and this was after a couple ribs and a couple tacos so I'm sorry if you know let me want a little more so this is me up close and personal sorry I'm looking in the viewfinder but um, I'm gonna zoom you in just a little bit so whoa, you can see all the crevices look at this side of my nose a little bit more full coverage than my other side so this is how it looks like on this side guys I look oily but it was just my primer I ran out of my matte primer and but so yeah this is what it looks like you can't really tell but I did not put a lot of product around it like I said I wanted to be more on the safe side um so let me kind of just oh that's super long on our way to the tattoo shop piercing shop whatever I was very nervous 
Um, I kept thinking, never mind, I don't want to do it. I was very hesitant, but then I was like, no, I'm going to do it. And then the second later, I was like, no, because I was just so nervous. I didn't think I was going to be able to handle the pain. Um, I didn't want to worry um, the piercer, and I didn't want to worry Edgar because he came with me if I, like, fainted or anything. I'm an overthinker if you don't know me. I was letting my thoughts regulate my decisions and um, I was really gonna back out before we parked. So when we parked, I was like, you know what? We're here. I'm gonna do it. So when I went in, she asked for my ID. I gave her my ID. And um, after she checked it, she gave me a form, um, an agreement form. She it basically just had a bunch of things that you had to initial, like if I had any medical implications, that I was agreeing that I would alert my piercer about the situations, all that good stuff, all that good stuff. To finish it off, I signed it and I was waiting for my turn because there was someone right before me and um, I only waited maybe two minutes. It was a walk-in, it was not an appointment. She cleaned up from the person before me and she, she showed me all the little studs that she had and um, I ended up picking this one. It is pink, but you can't tell. <laughs> we went to the back. She finally called us um, because after we picked, I picked it, she like did something else. But we waited for maybe about two minutes and she called me back and Edgar came with me. <clears throat> and it was kind of weird. I was like so like, oh my god, because her little area is all the way in the back of the um, tattoo shop in the corner and it's like totally like closed and like suctioned off, which I mean for privacy, that's great. But it just made it so more realistic. She placed a little dot to mark it and she was like, go see if you like this um, area. So I went and I was like, yeah, it looks fine. She was like, okay, get on up. So I sit on the table, chair, laying thing. I don't know. She was very fast. She was, like, she did this, she's been doing this for, like, years. She went through the motions, like, oh, my God. And I actually like that. Um, I mean, although she was going really fast, I felt like she was getting straight to the point and she was telling me everything that I needed to. So she was like, deep breath in, deep breath out. I'm going to do it on your deep breath out. So I was like, okay. So she was like, deep breath in, deep breath out. And she did it. And, and honestly, it didn't hurt. But I knew, and when you hear me say, oh, she <laughs> um, it's because I knew that she was going to have to twist it and I know that that's I've heard people say that that's the most painful thing I mean not that it hurts so much but that's mo the thing that hurts the most out of the whole procedure when she was putting the uh, ring through the little I don't even know these tools names but when she was putting it um, the stud through that little clear thing to pull it back out um, and twisting it yeah that hurt the most and I think that's where that's where the video cuts off um, my videographer <laughs> editor didn't film the whole thing but after she did that um, and I opened my eyes tears came rolling down like I was I was tearing up and I mean it wasn't hurting anymore, but like it was just from having them close from when she did it. When I was done, um, she was kind of telling more, me more information about how to clean it, how soon, um, just things here and there. And yeah, that was it. It was literally so fast. I feel like we weren't even in there for 10 minutes. From giving her my ID to paying, we weren't even in there for 10 minutes. And I actually liked that. I really enjoyed that. She charged me $20. She was having a sale. Normally, I think it's $40 there or $45, but she was not a sale. She was having like a special where you would go in that day from certain hours and it was a certain price, cheaper price, which yeah, that day it was $20. The stud that I got was included with that price and I ended up buying the little spray to clean around. This is saline wash and um, that was $10, so it ended up being $30 and then I gave her a $5 tip. I didn't have to give her a $5 tip, but she was really cool. She was a really sweet girl. If anybody who is looking to get a nose piercing is watching this video and contemplating, I think you should do it. Only if you're younger than 18, make sure you have your parents' permission. And um, I mean, if you're older, do it. 
but think about it first. Oh my god, I'm overthinking. Do it, do it, you'll be okay. I'm actually really glad that I did it. I would have never thought that I would have gotten a nose piercing. I used to always think like, oh my god, no, I would never. But <laughs> I lied. Just one more time for you guys to see if you want to see just a little bit more. So yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe and leave a like, maybe a comment if you're feeling generous. And click that bell notification so that you're notified every time I post, which is Sundays. But even though I just told you, still go press it so you know what time on Sundays, okay?